Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position and this has all the makings of a highly engrossing match. It's Trabzonspor and they face Minnesota United. Yeah, thanks as always, Derek. It's a pleasure to be here. Anticipating a really good game today. The atmosphere is great. Certainly buzzing from the spectators' point of view as we head towards kickoff. Hopefully, we won't be disappointed. And the lineup for the home side. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. And introducing the visitors lineup today. A standard 4 4 2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. And the match is underway. Lewis Baker. Baca set us with it. Baker. Well, great read there to intercept. Hansen. Promising sequence. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Under real pressure here. Wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed? Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Lee, in particular, what do you expect to see from his game? Well, yeah, when defenders look who they're playing against, they always look at the goals. Two goals in his last previous game. He's certainly a threat to them today. Couldn't keep it. Giannini. And it's with Ekuban. It looks promising. And disappointingly, he got completely underneath that. Well, here's a coaching tip. Long-range shot, lean back equals over the bar. I always listen to your coaching tips, Lee. <laughs> Kunu running with the ball confidently Hansen and there's the feed into the box high degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that and it was close well it's all about timing you've got to wait for the ball to come down and he's very very unlucky
Reynoso. Making progress. And the cross into the middle. The header, but far too straight to worry the keeper. Yeah, meat and drink for a goalkeeper of that class. Michael Boxall. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. A real opening now. It did look on for them, but not to be. Useful looking ball. Surely. Oh, what an opportunity. It's been squandered. Well, you dream of 1v1s as players. He's had one and he's squandered it big time. And giving the ball away. Derek, the visitors dominating possession. It's been really impressive. If they keep this pressure on, you feel a goal will come. Keep calm, no panic. Just a little bit more quality in front of the goal. Less than convincing defending. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Özdemir Edgar Ley Well he could really get at the opposition Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss Fragapani And the ball's gone And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, you might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Lee. Well, it's not been a great first half of football as far as he's concerned. He seemed a little bit sluggish to me, Derek. Easy for the back line to pick him up. Needs more movement. And the match is underway. It looks promising. And disappointingly, he got completely underneath that. Well, here's a coaching tip. Long-range shot, lean back equals over the bar. And there's the feed into the box. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, it's all about timing. You've got to wait for the ball to come. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Giannini. Lewis Baker. What can he do from here? Well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. Well, it was never going to worry the keeper. Well, no wonder he's looking a little bit sheepishly at his teammates. Head in a hand sort of moment. Boxall. Kunu. Not the pass he had in mind. Anthony Nwakeme. Is it going to be? 
will this corner bear fruit for them? Well, a chance to take the lead, it really is. The crowd sends a goal. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up and now both will rely on their respective benches. And firing it into the area. Well, trying his luck with the header, but too much elevation. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Abdul Kadir Parmak. Bakasetas with it. Berat Eibert Özdemir. certainly wasn't a clean tackle and the referee has got to book him I think that will certainly mean a booking here and now he's on a tightrope and a substitution in the offing Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Osvaldo Alonso. Well, no accuracy at all in terms of the shot unleashed. Well, it's the care and attention, all that work to get in the position and then way, way wide. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Edgar Ley. Berat Eiber Özdemir. surely he had just the goalkeeper to beat he's got it completely wrongly well he won't be watching that when he gets home tonight on a replay substitution time it is here Really good challenge. Chance to cross. The cross played over and work to do defensively. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick.
And now the delivery. Well clattered away. Osvaldo Alonso. It's with Gregush. Determined defending. Hussein Turkmen. Abdul Kadir Parmak. And in with a real chance. Can't miss, surely. Oh, he's failed comprehensively in front of goal. Well, it didn't look like there was going to be any goals in this game. There should have been one then. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Vitor Hugo, Abdul Kadir Parmak. The electronic board has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Can he put them in front? Oh no, he's failed under pressure. Well, that's his bread and butter, but he's going hungry tonight, Derek. We have entered the final minute of normal time. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes. And the match is underway. It looks promising. Disappointingly, he got completely underneath that. Well, here's a coaching tip. Long-range shot, lean back equals over the box. And there's the feed into the box. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, it's all about timing. You've got to wait for the ball to come. And firing it into the area. Trying his luck with the header, but too much elevation. That will certainly mean a booking here. And now he's on a tightrope. No accuracy at all in terms of the shot unleashed. Well, it's the care and attention, all that work to get in the position and then wait. And in with a real chance. Can't miss, surely. Well, that's his breath. 